I'm basically about to get arrested in front of my mom. I am here with Officer Eric, not a real officer. Not real. There is actually more now. Hey, what's going on? You're actually handy. Yes, man. Mama Rug in the cut, cooking it up in the kitchen. Okay, okay. <laughs> Mom, you want to feature in my new song? I love it. I would love to be a part of it. I'm cooking red rice and oh, meat. Oh, nice. And salad. Oh, 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 I got my man. Ma. <laughs> Yo, what's up, guys? How's everybody doing today? I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Welcome back to a brand new video. I'm just starting up the vlog. Mama Rug is cooking it up in the kitchen. Hey. Papa Rug is, I think, doing Christmas lights outside, and he's gonna turn this house into something crazy. Like, I'm excited to see the finished product. Did you just drink that? The water for the beets are good for you, they say. Really? We got Bosley the Sphinx just chilling. What's up, buddy? And then we got the hard worker, Papa Rug, doing some Christmas lights. Look at the Christmas tree he did yesterday. This took, what, like three hours? Yes. <laughs> Dad, yes. I haven't told them yet what I'm doing, but I just want to let them know that you're in on the prank. <laughs> Guys, I plotted something huge for today's video. So as you guys saw, I started my vlog downstairs. I wanted to make my mom think that I'm just gonna be vlogging today, you know, just a normal, regular vlogging day. But little does she know, she is about to get pranked super, super hard. <laughs> super hard. Basically, I have been planning on doing this prank since she last pranked me. So this is kind of like a revenge prank on her. If you guys missed her prank that she did on me, she made me think that I had a sister. Because back when I was two years old, my mom got pregnant with a baby girl, and unfortunately, she lost the baby. But in the prank, she told me that she actually had the baby and the baby was 19 years old and she brought her over to my house and I literally was face to face with my sister. So that was a pretty cruel prank, but mom, guess what? <laughs> I think I'm gonna top that. So on his way right now is a fake cop. Yup, I hired a fake cop for this prank video and you guys could probably guess where this is heading. I'm basically about to get arrested in front of my mom. And you guys all know my mom and for those who are new to this YouTube channel and don't really know anything about my videos, my mom worries a lot about everything, every little thing that we do, like she is worried 24-7. And that's how a mom is supposed to be. She's supposed to worry about her kid. But we are about to have a cop show up to the door and arrest me right in front of my mom. Handcuff me and everything. Mom, I love you and all, but don't think you're gonna get away with that prank that you did. So guys, I hope you do enjoy. I'm waiting for the fake cop to get here so we can discuss how we're gonna plan this. I'm gonna have cameras set up around the house. I think I'm gonna have him arrest me at the front door and I'm gonna try resisting. I'm gonna be like, yo, like get off of me. Like I didn't do anything. We're gonna see how this plays out. I hope you guys do enjoy. Please smash that like button, sit back, relax, and enjoy the prank. All right guys, I am here with officer Eric not a real officer not real but he is the one that's going to help me execute this prank and we just discussed what we're gonna do in order for me to be arrested and that's going to be me going 200 miles per hour on the freeway I missed two court dates and I've been an officer before on television oh hell yeah okay <laughs> so that's gonna make it a lot more believable and in the end he's gonna cuff me and he's gonna say we're gonna take you downtown we got some questions to ask yep. and uh, we're gonna see how my mom reacts you want to show them the cuffs yeah the cuffs are <laughs> so he's got shit. the cuffs ready he has a, a gun too okay. not gonna draw it yeah no because I didn't do anything too <laughs> crazy for you to draw the gun okay sure all right guys I'm gonna get the camera set up in the house and I'm going to text Eric when to come and execute this prank I hope you guys do enjoy did you like my picture on Instagram tomorrow uh, <laughs> oh you just... no thank you you can't like it now no no I want to see what like... you posted it's just so funny to hear. Oh, the selfie? Yeah. Okay. At first. I don't really recall. You don't recall? 
You've been subpoenaed to the court to appear to defend yourself in this matter twice since oh then. Where did they send that? Because we never received it. We had, it just sent, we had two court, court dates. Yes, you've had two court dates since since that day to defend yourself in the matter because you never paid. So there is actually a warrant out for your arrest what? regarding this matter. Wait, yeah. what did I do though? Like what? You were what? speeding. You don't remember speeding? You have a Lamborghini, is that correct, sir? Yeah, I do. Two hundred miles an hour. You were going over two hundred miles an hour. Brian, I didn't know. I I, I don't remember. My partner, Officer Brad, pulled you over. It was about nine fifteen in the evening. You don't recall this? Well, I I think I, I do, but okay. I, I didn't tell my partner. Okay, listen, now I'm sorry I have to do this, but I need to take you downtown so that me and my partner can talk to you about the matter. You've been you've been no. offered it. We've, we've been issued a warrant for your arrest. I don't want to have to take you into custody, but we do need to take you downtown to discuss the matter. Yeah. I, I don't, I I don't know. Just come and pick so. up my son and take him to We, I have a warrant. We, we have I something know, that we can do. It's, it's, it, it's a matter that your son has actually I, been ignoring for the last almost, almost I like personally year. have not received any of these in the mail. Have you? Like, I did understand, you but listen, I'm, I'm sorry I have to do I this. I mean, can we do it in a phone call? Can we call? No, can I call my lawyer? Because he you can bring your lawyer downtown with us. That's fine. You can have that person meet us there. Necessary to take him? Yes, right now. We no, have I don't think so. Yeah, we have to. I didn't do I don't. Sir, please. I, I don't want to embarrass you in front of your. No, your, I know, your, but I don't. I can't I go right now. I understand. I, it's, it, the, the problem is that you've already ignored two court orders to appeal. I, so I literally have haven't you. seen I understand that, and that's not. I'm sorry that you haven't seen them, but that is, this is part of, the, of our procedure at this point. Am I, so I need to take you downtown. Would you mind stepping yeah. out with me? And, uh, I don't know. I, I, can I just call my lawyer now? Can because call your lawyer, can. It's no problem. Just come I, take my son, just like this. I, have, they, I have to take him down. Downtown, yes. Okay. I, I don't, that, that's fine. I, you, you, you can follow us, but I, sir, I'm sorry. I, I can't. I, I, you have to come with me right now. If you don't come with me right now, if you don't come with me right now, I'm going to have to take you in the house. Okay. Because, no, I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, please. please. No Wait, but I have. So. Okay, do I get listen, anything? I'm sorry. Or? I have to take you into custody. You are not following my orders, and I need wait, to take you. Wait, why are you gonna? Please, please are you serious? Don't. Yes, just are he's you, not. He's not coming. Right. Right. This is not right. This is not right. Because you are not following my orders, and we're gonna. Are you serious? What's going on? Wait, I'm taking your. Please, you're don't. actually no. please don't. Yes, I am. I am. No, please don't resist. Do not resist. Call dad or something. What the no, hell? No, I'm gonna call Michael, but you can do that. Just we, like uh, Ma'am, I'm sorry. Ma'am, I'm sorry. Ma'am, down. Come on. Okay, hold on, please. please. Ma'am, please okay. do not. No, I don't. No, I don't you can. I've never seen you this before. Well. I, I understand know, that. This is how Feel free to call your lawyer. I'm sorry. This is not. I know this is not what you were expecting this evening, but your son is acting. I didn't expect that. Okay, please. Follow me, sir. Please follow me, sir. Brian, wait, please. You wait, can call, wait. You can call your lawyer. Please, okay. please do not, do not make him do anything more than I have. Please, I'm here for him. I can take him like this. This is actually something that your son has actually ignored. I know this is against the law to come just handcuff my son. Ma'am, if you want to call your lawyer, you can call your lawyer. My name is Officer McQuaid, badge number 4456. I can write it down for you if you like. I'm going to put him in the car. Which downtown? Where? I... We're going downtown, San Diego, San Diego downtown. No. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. Please. Okay. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm I, sorry. No. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ryan, please. No. Okay. Please, ma'am. I do not want to have to take you because I don't know. 212 miles an hour. He's missed two court dates. This is something that we have. There's a warrant. I don't want you to see me like that. I don't want you to see me like that. I'm sorry. Please come with me, sir. Please come with me, sir. Mom, mom, don't. Don't. I'm going to put him in the back of the car and I'll come back with my car. Okay, mom. Mom, I'm parked on the street. I'm parked right out on the street. I'll be right back. Call your lawyer. I'm not going. Mom, call. Put him in the back of the car. I'll come right back and talk to you. I understand you're under stress, but I have to take care of him. Mom, call the lawyer. Call the lawyer and tell him that it's just a prank. Mom, call the lawyer and tell him that it's just a prank. Mom, call the lawyer. I'm handcuffed. I'm handcuffed right now. <laughs> we got cameras pointing right here, right over there, and I've never been handcuffed in my life. <laughs> oh my god, that, you know what, I'm proud of the poor seeing Brian in the handcuffs. Oh my god. He's so good. Yeah. Wait, I was shaking. I, I was shaking. My heart, when I put that on a sock cop, my heart started beating. No way. I go, what made you want to Great work. That was amazing. Oh my god. Oh, I'm sorry. I did not mean to make you cry.
cry. I'm actually so sorry. Because I can't get you a ride in, like, in a handjob. Imagine. <laughs> Where's the car? Mom, you've just been pranked. That's what you get. You know, this is revenge prank. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Eric, man. What is it, Officer Be McQuaid? McQuaid. That's my character, Officer McQuaid, and my my partner, Officer Braddock, who's downtown because she couldn't make it. <laughs> I knew this was a prank, but I was scared still. Yeah. Like you, the way you made it seem was like a real, real cop. That was scary. See, I'm still shaking. I'm sorry, mom. I didn't mean to. I don't know if you this was a little to too overboard, way. but it was good. It was good. My mom has pranked me multiple times. Okay, don't oh, worry. Yeah? yeah. Then I don't feel bad. Like <laughs> she would. Never picture me to ever get arrested, of course. No, I mean, speeding and then I, I keep 200 in the Lambo. We didn't think about it, February. Did you have your Lambo? No, 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 no. Yes, that's so yeah, hilarious. You get like confused. Yeah, I have it. Mom, I love you. He's a hot cop. Dad, we killed the prank. We did it. Oh, oh, was it? it was great. No, she started crying. I felt so bad, guys. She started crying. Mom, how did you feel seeing your son in handcuffs? Bad, really bad. Really bad and scary and sad. I felt so bad. Crying is small for handcuffs. <laughs> like, I thought I was going to have to, like, pull your like, Yeah, no, no, no. Back, but I was like, it's fine. It's yeah, fine. right? Don't worry. I, I don't do anything bad. Yeah. Okay, guys, that is the end of the prank video. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you are new. If you're not subscribed already, what are you doing? Hit the subscribe button. Become a Rugrat today because the Rugrat army is the greatest army on YouTube. My dad started putting the lights. It's super, super windy out here. I don't know why. Like, I'm surprised the tree hasn't fell yet. But shout out to Officer McQuaid or Eric. He did a great job. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below of this prank. I had to get my mom back. Her prank was kind of cruel, so I had to top it. Let me know which prank you thought was better. I hope you guys all have a great rest of your day. And other than that, it's been Rug, and I'm out. Peace.